today I'm at the cliffs. When it comes to shooting in nature, it is very difficult to get a sense of size of the natural formations. That's why for today's tutorial we will be shooting this amazing landscape with the help of a model. But first of all, let us frame the shot with the right amount of zoom to compress the image and get a better parallax effect. Okay, perfect. Now, for our first shot, we are going to show the steepness of the cliffs by orbiting around the model in an upward motion. For this, we are going to move left and rotate right while moving up and tilting the camera down. Okay, for the next shot we are going to film the same spot without the model by moving right and rotating left while moving up and tilting the camera down. The idea for this shot is to show the viewer what the model is seeing and transport the viewer to this place. Now let's bring the drone back down to capture a couple more shots with the model. This time we are going to simply rotate around the model by moving left and rotating right. Notice that all shots so far have always had the ground as a foreground. This is very important when filming nature, especially when filming formations that are far away. Next let's do a more complex move. We are going to move right and rotate left while moving up and tilting the camera down to show the bottom of the cliffs. And then we invert the gimbal move while keeping the rotation and the upward movement to show the complete landscape of this place. Next, let's change the perspective and film the cliffs from the sea. For this, we are simply going to move forward and right while rotating left. Let's do the same thing but closer to the cliffs and in the opposite direction by moving forward and left while rotating right.
Mini 2 is taking a beating out there with these winds. The horizon is completely off level. Anyway, let's film a top down view of this rock next. For this, we are simply going to move down. Let's frame the rock properly first and also increase and also increase the altitude slightly. And now just move down. Let's repeat the shot, but now by moving up. Next, let's take a couple of clips of the lighthouse. Here, we are going to film the lighthouse by passing close to it in a simple forward motion. Let's position the drone properly first, so we don't hit the lighthouse. Okay, and now just move forward. And now let's reveal the landscape around the lighthouse by moving back and up while rotating the camera down. Let's now see an edited version of what we recorded today.